おうおうおうWelcome to TKO. I am the Tournament Master. Just an FYI, the elixir that gives me eternal life is beginning to affect the speech center of my brain, so if I use the wrong porcupines, that's why. I brought you all here to T-Shirt Island because you are the deadliest T-Shirt warriors I know. And because I hate being alone on my birthday. Your journey to victory begins here, at the training grounds. You will use your device to draw three drawings. You may draw whatever you choose. Go nuts with it! But if you're stumped, feel free to use the suggestion button. Begin your first drawing now! Only seconds remain. Excellent. This time, show me something different. Remember to use the suggestion button if you need an idea. Begin your second drawings.
time is about to expire, he may want to finish up. Excellent. Now really get nuts with this last one. Begin. Timer's not for decoration. Finish quickly! Hmm, yes, I think we can work with these. For your last exercise, you will write as many slogans or phrases as you can. Something really clever or really dumb. I'm sure anything you write will be one of those. And don't give in to pride, use a suggestion if you need it. Go! You didn't give up after one, did you? Keep writing! before time runs out. Yeah, you really dug deep that time. The time for training is over. Have a look at your device. Select one drawing and one slogan to create the perfect t-shirt combination. And I do mean perfect. Excellent. The time is nigh. Let the tournament begin. Gauntlet 1. Versus. Fight. Using your devices to vote. A new challenger appears. I want you to fight.
A new challenger appears. Fight each other! Versus Go ahead and fight already Winners! This feels like a good time for a training break. Use your devices to enter one new drawing and as many new slogans as you wish. Last chance to be clever? Go! Only seconds remain. <laughs> Begin writing. Time is about to expire, you may want to finish up. As we approach the second gauntlet, the cruel winds of chance have switched around your drawings and slogans. Forge a new t-shirt champion. Gauntlet 2 Versus Fight Versus Battle! 
A new challenger appears. Attack! Challenger appears. Fight. Yeah. Are you a shirtality? Brace yourselves for the final gauntlet where the toughest shirts from the previous rounds go toe to toe. Prepare to vote. Versus. Fight for me, baby. Fight. Versus Attack I'm glad I could see you all compete in this tournament before I died. Now if one of you would just give me some grandchildren. Welcome to the game. I'm Schmitty, but please don't tell my parole officer I'm here. Good group, good group. 
I just hope we're all friends after this. <laughs> Round one. You'll get two prompts on your device. Just answer them however you want. Your responses, or quips, will be pitted against someone else's, and everyone will vote on their favorite. You get points based on the percentage of people who like your answer, and a bonus if you get more votes than your opponent. Go! Almost out of time. Use the safety quip button if you have to. Okay, here we go. The first prompt is a rejected church hymn, Swing Low, Sweet Blank. Okay, pick your favorite and vote. Coming up next, what you wish you could say to yourself as a high schooler. Ready, set, vote! Next in line, a terrible name for a street drug. Okay, vote. Moving on, never touch the blank. It's voting time. And next, don't throw out those used chopsticks. They could be used to blank. Float away. Round one is in the books. Let's see the scores. <laughs> now for round two. Double the points and bonuses, double the excitement.
All right, let's have a look. Prompt number one is how the view will finally end. Okay, vote for your favorite. Next on the list, remember when buying a new home, always make sure the previous owner didn't blank. Get to voting! And next is... The perfect man is tall, dark, and blank. Put in your votes. Up next, the most pointless volunteer work would be helping the blank. Vote now. Okay, next one. What should be dumped on the losing coach at the end of a football game? And vote. Round two's done. Let's see who's winning now. <laughs> Round three has arrived. The last lash. You're all going to answer the same prompt, so pull out all the stops. Make up a phrase that goes with this acronym. All right, brace yourselves. It's round three, so you've got three medals to award. A gold, a silver, and a bronze. Make your picks. Brace yourselves, here come those medals. Bronze first. 
Here's the silver. And the gold. All right, let's turn that into cold, hard points. Okay, let's see those final scores. Join the party. Join us. Join the party. <laughs> Meow, do not be startled. I am here to guide you as we explore the deepest recesses of your mind. You will build strange and complex worlds using only your imagination. I'm about to throw your sense of right and wrong into a blender. And I'm adding kale so it's healthy. Get ready to... Split the room. Finish the scenario that has been sent to your device. And now, I Love Hate New York. You have been banned from New York City. You know what you did. In order to set foot in there again, you must do this. Do you do it?
The longer it takes the room to answer, the more bonus points you get. Here's one I like to call... Grit your teeth and bear it. Your mouth is riddled with cavities. The dentist is going to have to pull all your teeth, unless you brush twice a day with this instead of toothpaste. Do you adopt this new brushing method? It's time for Channel Roulette. In front of you sits a TV with five channels. Four of them are travel channels. The fifth channel is devoted to this. Once you turn it on, you will be instantly transported to a fully paid weekend vacation to the location that appears on screen. Do you turn it on? Super split. Mm. Brace yourself for memory switch. Whenever you do something embarrassing in public, you have the power to erase that moment from people's minds. However, that memory will be replaced with this. Your pants just fell down at the airport. Do you use your powers? Get ready for the challenge. A new social media movement encourages people to post a video of themselves doing this to raise awareness for hepatitis B. It is well known that you support this cause. Do you participate? where everybody stacks up at the moment. It's time to create some more havoc. Up next is a dead deal. 
you can bring this person back to life. But by doing so, you have to send this person back to the year 1930. Do you do it? Super split. Mm. Feast your eyes on trolling the watering holes. An augmented reality app allows you to see who has a crush on you. In order for it to work, you have to take a picture of them holding this. Do you carry this object around when you go to the bars? And now, Binge Pipe presents An Actor's Strife. You are a struggling actor who gets offered a big role in a wildly successful film franchise. But in the biggest scene of the film, you will be required to do this. Multiple times. Do you do it? Super split. Mm. This scenario is called the Shutterbug. A stranger approaches you on the street and reveals that he has pictures of you doing this. He won't release them as long as you give him the underpants you're wearing right now. Do you do it? This one is called A Rose by Any Other Surname. You found the love of your life. Hooray. Everything about them is just perfect. However, their last name is this. They ask that you take that name when you get married. It means the world to them. Do you? Let's check in with the standings. We've reached the decisive dimension. Everybody will be presented with a new type of scenario. There will be two options to choose from. Door number one is already provided. You will decide what's behind door number two. Remember, you want to make it as hard of a choice as possible. Oh, and if you correctly predict a certain player's decision, you'll earn some bonus points. Let's begin. 
write an option that you think only some people would choose. Time's running out. You're on a reality romance show. You have to marry one of the two final contestants. They're both nice, but one speaks only in monotone and the other does this. Which contestant do you marry? I don't think you thought this through. Well played. Let's switch things up. You've been planning to break up with your significant other for months. You have to do it now, on vacation, because you think they might be about to propose. You can break the news to them on a zip line through the jungle, or while doing this. What's the better breakup spot? It all comes down to this. 